these guys are incredibly hot to handle so just be very careful when you're pulling them apart or removing them from the air fryer because they are seriously hot check that out take a look at the inside here cheers I can promise you that this is instant mashed potatoes because it tastes like my childhood. So I'm here today to taste test the viral sweet potato bread that's been blowing up all over the interwebs. Pretty much every social media platform has a person talking about this viral sweet potato bread and you can find it at HMart or your local Korean market. I had the toughest time trying to find these sweet potato breads. I could not get my hands on it anywhere because it was always sold out. But luckily the team at Asian Mart over in Fairfield, they're basically a convenient store that specializes in Asian snacks. They actually drove all the way down from Fairfield to the Bay Area in order to hand deliver these to me. So I am so, so grateful. And not only did they give me this flavor, they actually gave me the chestnut flavor as well as the potato flavor. So now I have all three flavors and I thought I would do a taste test and figure out which one of these three is the best. And if this sounds familiar, it's because Instagram saw it first. So if you don't already follow me on Instagram or TikTok at Eats by Rachel, definitely make sure to do so. So let's go ahead and pop these guys in the air fryer. It takes about 20 minutes at 338 degrees Fahrenheit, which I feel like is a very specific number. I don't know if anyone else's air fryer can be dialed up to 338, but I kind of just rounded it and I'm gonna hope for the best. I think rounding it should be good enough. Each of the flavors has the same cook time and instructions, so I popped one of each into the air fryer and I am just waiting for them to be done at this point. They are out of the air fryer now and let's go ahead and kick things off with the sweet potato bread, the OG. These guys are incredibly hot to handle, so just be very careful when you're pulling them apart or removing them from the air fryer because they are seriously hot. This is the original sweet potato with the purple coating. I really don't know how they get this like beautiful purple coating and you can see the steam just kind of like rising out of that. It's crazy. I really don't know what they use to make it super purple, whether it's food coloring or maybe a more natural dye. Cheers. Mmm, mmm, that's really good. So the sweet potato filling inside is like golden and lush really fresh tasting given that it's frozen as well. I like that the mochi layer is thin but not too thick and chewy because sometimes mochi can get this really gummy like texture but it's a pretty thin coating so I think it works well and balances with the sweet potato a lot. I can see why there's a ton of hype around this. It's, it's pretty good. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Starting off strong guys. So next let's do chestnut. Take a look at the inside here. This guy's got like a big ball of filling in the center and then the mochi coating is still needs to be like wiggled off a little bit. But anyway, let's let's try it. Hmm. I'm looking for chestnut, but I'm getting more like sweet potato cinnamon. I'm searching for that chestnut flavor, but I'm really not finding it. It tastes more like sweet potato and cinnamon, maybe even a little bit of a coffee-like flavor, but Chestnut is something I love and I love Mont Blancs. So I was super excited for this one, but honestly, I do not taste the chestnut at all. It really lacks that chestnut flavor. I think the shape is super cool. It looks like chestnut, but flavor wise, it's totally off the mark. Last but not least is the real potato or the regular potato. And I thought this one actually smelled the best. It kind of smells like instant mashed potatoes that you would buy at the store in one of those like packets and you just like add water and then it magically becomes mashed potatoes. That is what this smells like. And honestly, I was kind of obsessed with that as a kid. So I'm, I'm down. Cheers. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Brings me right back. Oh yeah. I can promise you that this is instant mashed potatoes because it tastes like my childhood. I actually really like this one and maybe it's only because it's the savory one out of the bunch and I've had a lot of sweets today. But honestly, this tastes like instant mashed potatoes. I love it. It's kind of like a little pocket-sized mashed potato snack. And I could see myself going for this anytime. And shout out again to Asian Mart and Fairfield. If you want to get your hands on these viral sweet potato breads or chestnut bread or potato bread, you can go to their storefront in Fairfield and actually pick up a bag of each of these flavors yourself. I feel like you guys have been loving these viral food product videos. So let me know which one you want to see next. And confession, I actually really love running around to different grocery stores. I do it anyway, but I love doing it to find viral foods to figure out which one has it in stock, which one is like limit two per person and whatnot. I actually find it really fun. It's almost like an Easter egg hunt for me. I, I don't know why. But if there's something super viral that you want me to try to let you guys know whether or not it's worth it to buy it, let me know. I will be there and I will go find it. So thanks again for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.